to hot. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a cup of water. So first you go to the cabinet and you take a cup, see it's a cup, and then you go to the fridge and you put it under the water. You are fancy, fancy, schmancy. Now you say, Baruch Baruch Atah Tadar Chayim Hanachalam Shakuni Yabir Vara. Amen. You drink it. Now, here's another way to do it. So you go to the sink, you put your cup under the sink, and then you flip it on. Voila! Masters in their field. World-class chefs with extreme confidence and incomparable skill. Chopped is about inspiring you to learn how to cook. And since we're all home, and we're all eating, and we're all cooking, or baking, please feel free to take a couple moments and shoot a video of what you've made and share it with me so you could appear on Chopped. This is how you make chocolate chip cookies. First, you have to preheat uh, um, your oven to 350. And then you start baking. So you have to get one cup of butter or two sticks. Dump it in. One cup of sugar. One cup of light brown sugar or uh, regular brown sugar, doesn't really matter. And then you have to uh, mix it until it's light. Look, all light and fluffy, and then after that we're going to we're going to keep on rolling it. Then you have to add two eggs. Do it, you should do it one at a time. Okay. Oh yeah, make sure you take the blood spots. And then um, you take one teaspoon of baking soda. And then one teaspoon of vanilla. And then a pinch or a teaspoon of salt. And now you want to set this uh, the lowest you can, so I'm on the low. And th there's two cups of flour in here. So you're gonna gradually put some flour in until it becomes a batter. So once it's all done, once you pour on all the flour, it's look a little something like this. And then all you have to do is add in, it says uh, uh, like a certain amount of chocolate chips, but I just do a whole bag for the little chocolate chips, but you could do however much you want. Dump them in there. A little bit more. And then, this is a batter. So, now you have to put it on a wax paper or cooking sheets on a on a pan and then take a spoon or something and make little balls of 12 and then you put them in the oven and then they're ready. So I just put my cookies in. Um, they they make 36 cookies. This is how they look like. Um, I set my timer for 12 minutes. Every oven's a little different. 10 to 12 minutes is okay but it always, you never know. You should always check on them to see if they're ready. And I'll show you them when they come out. I'll just take the last cookies out. If they're crisp at the edges, that means that they are ready. So you have to wait for them to cool down. And then we're going to taste. The cookies have just cooled down. And now I'm about to taste them. Really good. 